BrainTech here, where tech is made simple. So as I have been posting, as of January the 4th this year, 2024, Google started enabling a feature called tracking protection in 1% of all Chrome web browsers. And here's the feature um, enabled in Chrome Canary, which you may well know by now is a preview version of Chrome. And the whole reason for this, according to Google, um, this is their first phase of ending third-party quickie support in Chrome, which they were planning to do by the end of this year, 2024, as I've mentioned previously. And I'll leave a video I posted earlier this month in the end screen if you'd like to play catch up and get a little bit more information. Now, just a quick recap for today's video. As many of you may know, cookies can be useful because when a cookie from a certain site is on your device, it means, as an example, you don't have to keep continuing to sign into that account every time or that site every time you visit that certain website. But one of the downsides is that obviously um, third-party cookies can be used to track you online for marketing purposes. And this, according to Google, is why they want to remove them entirely from the Chrome web browser um, by the end of this year and replace them with a feature called Google Privacy Sandbox, which is part of tracking protection. And Google Privacy Sandbox basically means you would get targeted ads in Chrome and while you will get targeted ads, though, according to Google, it would limit cross-site tracking. Okay, so that's just a brief recap if you would be interested. Now, in regards to blocking all third-party cookies in Chrome, another spanner has been um, placed, so-called, in the works. And this seems to be a backwards and forwards process. But the latest now is that, um, obviously, the web advertising industry is not um, too happy about this for obvious reasons. And... Because of this now, the Competition and Markets Authority, CMA, has raised complaints that it doesn't protect your user privacy enough using Privacy Sandbox. So basically, that's the complaint against Google. So because of this now, Google say they are going to be postponing the um, deprecation and the ending of third-party tracking cookies in Chrome by the end of this year, 2024. And they have said in a recent statement, and I'm going to quote this, we recognize that there are ongoing challenges related to reconciling divergent feedback from the industry, regulators, and developers, and will continue to engage closely with the entire ecosystem. It's also crucial that the CMA has sufficient time to review all evidence, including results from industry tests, which the CMA has asked market participants to provide by the end of June. Given both of these significant considerations, we will not complete third-party quickie deprecation during the second half um, of this year, 2024. So that's a clear indication now that the um, ending of third-party quickies uh, in Chrome will be postponed to at least the beginning of next year, 2025. And according to that statement, we can see that this is all possibly going to take place the deprecation of third-party cookies in Chrome um, at least by the beginning of next year, 2025. So I'm just putting it out there. We have been talking about this on and off on the channel. It's been quite a backwards and forward process. But nonetheless, that's the latest. And if I get any more news and if you are using Chrome and would be interested, I'll post and keep you guys in the loop. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.